Hello everyone, today we shall talk about the unique reproductive hierarchy among clownfishes or anemonefishes. These fishes belong to subfamily Amphiprionini in the family Pomacentridae. 30 species of clownfish are recognized, one in the genus Premnas, while 29 are in the genus Amphiprion. In the wild, they all form symbiotic mutualisms with sea anemones. In a group of anemone fish, a strict dominance hierarchy exists. The largest and most aggressive female is found at the top. Only two anemone fish, a male and a female, in a group reproduce through external fertilization. Anemone fish are protandrous sequential hermaphrodites, meaning they develop into males first, and when they mature, they become females. If the female anemone fish is removed from the group, such as by death, one of the largest and most dominant males becomes a female. The remaining males move up a rank in the hierarchy. The other clownfish do not breed unless the female dies then one of them becomes the dominant male, while the old dominant male becomes the new breeding female. Anemone fish lay eggs on any flat surface close to their host anemones. In the wild, anemone fish spawn around the time of the full moon. Depending on the species, they can lay hundreds or thousands of eggs. The male parent guards the eggs until they hatch about 6 to 10 days later, typically 2 hours after dusk.